Hello guys, welcome. In this video, we are going to get started with the PSOC6 Wi-Fi Bluetooth Pioneer Kit from Cypress Semiconductor. Let's open the box and exclude what's inside. Information Brochure TFT Shield PSOC6 Wi-Fi Bluetooth Development Board Type-C USB Cable Four jumper wires along with two proximity wires. This PSOC development kit has been designed for users to develop next generation Internet of Things applications using Wi Fi and Bluetooth low energy technology. As you can see, this is Morota Wi Fi and Bluetooth on a single chip. The PSOC6 comes with dual core ARM Cortex M4 at a frequency of 150 MHz and a ARM Cortex M0 Plus at a frequency of 100 MHz. So up to 104 user accessible GPU pins are available for user access in order to control the inputs and outputs. Another feature we can observe here, the PSOC comes with Arduino type Arduino Uno type connections that can be used to interface the external shield to the PSOC6 development board. On the board left top, you can see the type C USB port which can used to upload the code and power up the board. At the left bottom, we have two buttons. The left button is user accessible switch. This means if you need to add a switch button to your project, you can use this button by simply enabling it through the software. The right switch button is a reset button. This resets the MCU when you press it. On this PSOC6 development board, you can see two types of capacitive touch sensor. One is capacitive touch slider and below these two are capacitive touch pads. There are three LEDs available for users for programming and interfacing on a single board. The big LED which you are seeing here is the RGB LED and other two LEDs are normal single color LEDs. The TFT shields comes with the PSOC development kit. The TFT shields contains 2.4 inch TFT display, ambient light sensor, 6 axis motion sensor, PDM microphone.